as shown in figure, this is the equivalent circuit of induction motor. There are two parts of this circuit, one is stator and other is rotor. These are the real values of resistances and inductances of an induction motor. R1 is 1 ohm, X1 is 3 ohm, R0 is 10 ohm, X0 is 50 ohm, R2 dash is 1 ohm and X2 dash is 2 ohm. RL dash is load resistance. The sum of R0 and X0 is 10 plus 50 J, while the sum of R1, X1, R2 dash and X2 dash is 2 plus 5 J ohm. In no load test, the resistance of load is made infinite. In induction motor this is made by making slip 0. As there is infinite resistance at rotor side, the current will not flow through R2 dash, X2 dash and RL dash. As the current flows through R0 and X0, the corresponding values are measured. So we can find I0 current, winding current IW and magnetizing current IMU. In blocked rotor test, the load resistance is made zero. It is made zero by blocking the rotor from rotating, so slip will be one. As slip will be one, RL dash will be zero. As RL dash is zero, the resistance of R0 plus X0 becomes more. Resistance if R0 plus X0 is 10 plus 50 J, while that of R01 dash and X01 dash is 2 plus 5 J ohm, so current flows through that path. Now we can measure the values of R01 and X01 of the circuit.